any mission-driven organization is about solving a problem. And it is monumentally difficult, if not impossible, to understand the problem without understanding the context, trends, whether they are political, social, economic, cultural, that affect the mission of the organization and how it goes about solving that problem. We're at an inflection point. If you look at some of the factors in our environment we're contemplating right now, whether that's uh, food insecurity, almost 300 million people being food insecure, or refugees, 100 million people. I think it's the highest number ever in the history, in the recorded history of humanity. Um, if you look at um, the invasion of Ukraine, uh, if you look at um, some of the economic problems caused by the pandemic and other factors, uh, ranging from uh, inflation to lack of economic opportunity to, to unemployment in some parts of the world. Well, this confluence of events in some ways is very similar to what happened about eight years ago and gave rise to fascism and communism. And we have now pretty good data that says at that point of inflection, there were two things that happened. One is uh, there was a break of trust in communities. And two, the elites, the governing elites actually broke down. They also had distrust. So when I look at development gateway and what we together can do with data and digital technologies and data, that can be quite transformational in building trust in communities, between people, in public institutions, and social trust is very much a secret source of helping prevent conflict and instability for hundreds of millions of people worldwide. And so I think this goes directly to the relevance and the value add of development gateway. This new strategy makes us think more boldly about the future, about where we want to go and how we want to get there. And to me, in brief, this new strategy takes us to the problem, but with a bolder ambition about the scale and the depth of you know, our delivery and our impact with better talent, better tools, and a re-energized sense of purpose and mission. And I'm hugely excited by the fact that Development Gateway through this new strategy has chosen to, in three rather short years, catalytically and greatly move the needle in four major directions. One, improve service delivery for those who need them most in typically poor or resource deprived environments. Two, radically improve the quality of governance by making public institutions more transparent and combating manipulative information. Three, by taking data and its intersection uh, with digital technologies to how public institutions advance their mission, especially in conflict or poor environments. And four, very important to uh, approach all of this with a lens of inclusion. We've chosen to use the lens of youth and gender to bring typically excluded voices to the table of decision-making.